Alrighty, thanks for joining us today, guys. Going over the 2022 Forest River Rockwood. It's going to be a mini light series, a 2516S. This coach is going to come in here at 6,033 pounds. So any mid-sized truck, mid-sized SUV, you know, smaller pickups, going to be able to tow this thing very comfortably. Going to be also having a front kitchen, so we're going to be able to see how nice that is. If you do have a kind of a lake front there in front of the unit, you can cook food, you know, wash stuff up in the sink, and look out that windshield right there to your guys' perfect view. Going to have a theater seating in it there, 12 volt refrigerator, so we're going to see how much room that does have compared to the typical propane fridge that would be in a unit like this. Big queen bed there in the back of the coach. Going to have a big slide. Open that bedroom up. You guys are going to have plenty of room to walk around that bed. All right, here, guys. Thanks for joining me again. My name's Nathan Anderson. I'm going to be taking you through a tour here of a 2022 Forest River Rockwood. This is going to be a 2516. Start off right off the top here. You guys are going to have a power tongue jack. Super nice. You guys will just press a button there run that up and down on your guys' tow vehicle. This little cap here, pop that open. You guys do have a manual option. If that power ever fails, you guys can still get it up and off your tow vehicle. We'll have a battery box that is big enough to fit two batteries. Solar people will appreciate that a lot. Also, we'll have your guys' battery disconnect up under there on the tongue. You guys are away there for the weekend. Crank that to off. Don't have to ever worry about anything draining the battery. Your guys' water heater will be here, easy to access. Flip that open. You guys can do your winterizations, flip it to bypass mode, whatever you want to do. This will be your guys' solar plug that will come standard there on every Rockwood. You guys can put another solar panel there. Rockwood does have an option. Two solar panels on the roof now is an option from the manufacturer. Can also plug a third one into there too. So move this one around towards the sun. A lot more efficient there compared to the roof. Big grab handle, you guys don't have to worry about missing that. Sliding there off the uh, step above more ride system. These will reach the ground. These legs are adjustable, super easy. Press that button, move that leg in and out. Always stable no matter kind of what terrain you guys are on. TV mount, exterior of the coach here, same mount that's gonna be in the inside. Take that TV, pull it out here, bring the party out here, tailgate, whatever you guys do there on the weekends. You guys will also have two exterior speakers. Other ones over there on the door, you guys can again adjust those, what zones you guys wanna play music through, indoor, outdoor, or all three zones. All of your guys' TV preps here, cable, inlet, outlet. Also, we'll have your guys' 110 outlets. Down here, you guys will have an aluminum uh, star style design there on your guys' wheels. And the Rockwood Mini Light will come standard with Goodyear Endurance tires. That tire is what most people will switch to if they buy kind of a, a less power unit, so to say. They will immediately throw in the Goodyears. Very good tires, very good tires. Also, we'll have a second entry door. A lot of companies do cheap out. They'll put those normal flip down style steps here, not Rockwood. Two style more ride steps here that will lift up on a strut. Super easy to lift up too, guys. I mean, that's one hand here, super easy. Older people will appreciate that. You guys aren't fumbling there with the flip up, smashing fingers. Over here, you guys will have a pick and knee rail. That rail is gonna be where you guys put that um, Blackstone style cooktop that will be provided there from Rockwood. Will come standard, kind of be a little mini Blackstone, Greystone style cooking surface and a little prep table will also fit on there. Alrighty here guys, now to the rear of the 2516. Start from the top, you guys will have the backup camera prep. Do sell those Furion backup cameras in the parts store. That will go up there, super easy, already prepped. Will be more of an observation camera. Stays on 24 seven. Also, you guys will have the frameless windows. I like these. They will pop out this way. That way if it's raining, you guys want some fresh air, rain will not get inside that coach. Nice spare tire carrier. You guys keep that spare tire out of the elements, sun, worry about it fading, dry rotting, etc we'll have your guys' ladder here on the back. You guys will notice a lot of manufacturers are getting rid of the ladders, liability claims, et cetera. You will still have that rear ladder on the Rockwood. You guys can get up there, service your guys' roof every six months, change your AC filters, whatever you guys do that route. Also below, you guys will have a two inch style receiver. That is a big deal. You guys can put a bike rack there, kayak carrier, whatever you guys wanna do. 
Right here, guys, now to the kitchen here on the front nose of the 2516. Immediately going to know you guys will have a Magic Chef stainless steel microwave complete with your guys' range. That's a light. That's a fan there to suck up all the fumes there from your guys' cooking. Also having a cool little knife holder back here. A lot of customers ask me, what, what are those slits for on the back? That's for your guys' knives. Super nice, convenient spot for them. This glass cooking top here will flip back. That will make another backsplash. You guys, it's nicer to clean it off glass than it is the actual backsplash. We'll have an oven there below, nice little storage door, and this will be solid surface countertops. Not porous, doesn't allow stuff to soak up, smell, and it doesn't burn if you, maybe you put a pot and pan right out of the oven, right on top of it. We'll have a stainless steel sink here. This does pull down here that will be able to wash out pots, pans that don't fit outside. You guys can wash them out in here. Also do have the topper here. You guys can use it as like maybe a drying rack. More storage here for a, another prep surface if you guys need it. Bunch of overhead storage, bunch of lights, tons and tons of outlets. You guys look around, you can put all of your mixers, kitchen appliances here, USB connections, bunch of storage again over here underneath the sink storage. And you guys will have a cool little storage here on the back. Those cabinets go all the way to the front of the nose. Complete here to finish off the uh, kitchen section of the coach. It's gonna be your guys' 12 volt refrigerator. It's gonna be 11 cubic foot, three cubic foot bigger than a gas electric back in the day. That fridge will run while it's going down the road off your 12 volt uh, towing vehicle there. And it will also run off your guys' solar panel too. Right here guys, now to the theater seating here of the 2516. You guys are on, this is going to be able to pop down. You guys can fit about three people on here. You guys will have a 110 outlet, two USB chargers, cup holders, and this will also have a power option here. Flip that out, recline them, and then you guys do have manual backup strap there you guys can pull out. Here's your guys' TV that will come standard with a Rockwood. We'll have a TV in it. Also underneath here, you guys will have your fireplace. About 5,100 BTUs, that's gonna supplement your furnace. Blow nice warm air on you if you guys are sitting here. Maybe it's a, a colder season kind of camping. Right here guys, now to the bathroom located here in the middle of the coach. Right off the top, you guys notice a nice glass shower enclosure. Most manufacturers will cheap out, kind of just do a curtain right there, complete with your guys' overhead skylight. Taller guys will appreciate that. A lot more headroom there. Complete with a nice little nooks and crannies here for medicine, etc. You guys will be able to open that. Tons of storage behind it. Sink here, complete with a nice little stainless steel faucet. And also tons of storage underneath. 110 outlets about everywhere you look. Behind the toilet here, guys, tons of storage. Don't see this a whole lot in the bathroom. Nice, big, deep, tall storage compartments. All your guys' bath essentials, towels, etc., whatever you want to put in there. Also, we'll have your porcelain bottom toilet here. Typical foot flush RV style toilet, complete with a nice position. Your guys' feet are hanging out of the doorway. Ready right here. Now to the back here of the camper. This is going to be your guys' master bedroom. It's going to have a bed slide. That bed slide is going to allow you guys to walk around both sides of the bed, be able to get ready, not fight over each other, not crawl over the bed to get somewhere. Super nice position. This will also lift up all of your guys' storage will be underneath here. Lots of storage that will go to a compartment on the outside and this will these drawers do pull out that way you guys can get this stuff without pulling the bed up. Also complete you guys will have nice little ledges there to store maybe a sleeping machine, cell phone, tablet. You guys will have USB chargers over here, 110 outlets, reading lights above your guys' heads, storage compartments above that. Over here on this side, one thing you guys are gonna notice, Rockwood does not shy away in the wardrobe. You guys are gonna have a kind of a his and her style setup. Nice little rack above here. You guys can stow away hangers, hang clothes up, complete with maybe a, a dresser underneath here, maybe stow away your shoes, etc. Thanks for joining me today here, guys. Again, my name's Nathan Anderson. This was the Rockwood Mini Light 2516. Do have some of these in stock. Give my sales team a call here, Team Anderson at 937-649-5823.